What about your opinion of women when you were a kid changed by doing doing this job? So what about my opinion about women has yeah, changed? Yeah, because when you're a young man, you're like, you know, girls are nice and they smell nice and, you know, sugar and spice and all things nice. And then you start doing bachelorette parties and, you know, all these sorts of gigs. Like, what opinions about women changed? Well, I uh, will. Hopefully this doesn't uh, get complex, but if it does, uh, let me know. Um, you know, I've always been a very self-aware kid, man. Like I question everything. I've always been, I'm always the, the little philosopher um, asking questions about anything and everything. When I was a kid growing up, you know, born in 1990, watching the late night shows, comedy shows, I always noticed the guy was played as a the, the dad was the bath, the bathroom, the, the idiot mm -hmm. husband. Right. Yeah. And I always, I always question. I remember I was a teenager, like, why is the father always the idiot? Like, isn't there like some kind of, you know, alpha, like in a comedy show, like a, some kind of alpha guy, why are they portraying the dad as a, as a idiot? And then, mm -hmm. um, my upbringing, you know, I, I always heard the, Oh, you know, men ain't shit or, your so-and-so dad ain't shit or and then you hear like other single moms or blah 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 like you hear it like there's just a constantly repetitive thing mm. but i always noticed too with um you know just a common thing uh, socially too what i've noticed growing up and um as soon as i started diving in i just i noticed also you know women aren't as um sweet and s sweet and nice like everyone uh portrays them to be because i once i started working the field like yeah like women as uh, women are as horny and want all these nasty things just like men like what what are people talking about that mm -hmm. women aren't um don't want rough sex and or you know they don't they don't crave these things of course they are they're they're human just like us mm -hmm. Uh, but the, I mean, honestly, it, it has changed now in wanting to get married. I'm going to be completely honest. Like I, I don't want to, um, even the parties that I do, or even that the black girl that I met at the show, like there's a, there's a small amount of hope, but it's not like how it used to be like traditional values. Um, and with, I think I'm going all over the place, but yeah, I, I just, I wouldn't get married, man. Um, unless like I'm married or, you know, unless I meet somebody and the state is on the man's side with 50, 50, but you know, I've read your book. I've gone really deep into a lot of different, uh, things when it comes to, uh, what would happen if a man gets divorced in a state that doesn't favor, a 50 50 in the court system like mm -hmm. yeah that's, that's just not ideal so yeah that's how it's changed i hope that answered yeah. it yeah no that no, that makes sense because i guess you see them would you call them at their worst or behaving their worst for the bachelorette parties yeah in some cases yeah sometimes they you know they just want a, a cute guy with his butt cheeks out um in an apron just serving them drinks and, you know, uh, they'll just flirt, but they won't take it to the, to the distance of, they want to, you know, they'll, they'll ha want to have sex with me or, uh, any of the guys there. And sometimes some parties do take it far. I really hope you guys enjoyed that clip. If you want to watch the full length podcast, you can find that over here, that clips from, if you're newer to the channel, make sure you hit subscribe over here and pin down below in the top comment. You'll find a bunch of useful links to my website, my supplement line books, and a bunch of other stuff. Have an amazing day. Peace out.